Yo, I'm super proud of Nicki Minaj today. Even on the morning, Laura Styles of Rosenberg. Super proud. Why no, is that? You know, because her ex-boyfriend out here yapping, right? Mm-hmm. And by the way, he was never a public figure. So for him to be running around doing interviews, is, that's super lame. And I believe that that's the reason why they broke up. Because he wanted to be a part. He wanted to be somebody. Like, how are you with Nicki Minaj? You can't play the back, my G. Right. You can't... You, you, you know he was chilling, getting cars, motorcycles, and all that. He was chilling, living in the houses, all that. Yeah. You can't just kick back, start a business. The craziest thing. Buy a, buy a Dunkin' Donuts franchise. You can't get a wing stop, Maji. Or how about this? Go manage another artist. Go find other artists you work with. Something. No, he wanted to be an artist. I think he's putting out music now, too. Nah, see, that's the problem. Remember when he threatened to punch me in the face? Um, anyways. No, I don't remember that. He threatened to punch you in the face? After Summer Jam. Really? Yeah, he turned out nice when I ended up seeing him. I don't have any problem with the guy now at all, but I mean, I don't like how he's moving right this moment. But I spoke to Nikki yesterday, and she was upset about all of this. And I just told her to be patient, because in a couple weeks, it'll all be gone, and people won't be talking about your ex and your old relationships and blah, blah, blah. But she was most upset about the idea that someone else was writing her rhyme. He said that? Why he said that? He asserted that there was help. There was help. And you know, when you look at Nicki Minaj's album credits, there's a lot of people who work on albums. People who pick beats, people who write a hook, people who, you know, that's how it goes. When you with somebody you like, But when yo. you assert that somebody wrote your rhymes, you know that's Nikki's thing. Mm. Yeah. But I told her, I was like, yo, that's why he did it, because he, he knew that would hurt you. Because he knew that was your weak spot. I'll yeah. tell you, my favorite thing in all of this, and my, when I say favorite, I mean the worst thing, is when I see on TMZ, they're now treating him like he's like a celebrity, and he's out with some new chick driving in some ridiculous car in L.A., my man, how are you going to pimp to new chicks in a car that your old girl bought you, my man? <laughs> oh, God. I mean, I'm sorry, but that's just so, Like, you got to at least go get a job at, like, a restaurant and save up for your own car. Yeah. Because I can't pimp all to right, a- All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What, is that bad? That's just care. enough, man. All right, man. I felt like we was going to yeah, go ahead yeah. on No, no, kid, I don't man. hate the guy. It's just, it's just like, he just needs to chill Let's- out. 